What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Today has been a day I've been waiting for for a long time guys. Me and my dad recently bought our first bass boat. You can see with the cover on it, but you can't actually see it yet. I'm about to show you guys, but you gotta wait. But yeah, I am so happy right now. I am super excited to get it out in the water. Um, you know, use it all. There's so many cool features in this one. Uh, it's just awesome. So yeah, I'm gonna show you guys every inch of this boat down to the finest detail and yeah, so I'm gonna just give you guys like a walk through. So no more talking, let's dive right into it. I hope y'all enjoyed that awesome slow-mo reveal of the boat. Uh, yeah, but anyway, we got the cover off and yeah, here it is y'all. It's a pretty sweet looking boat. Uh, let's dive right into it. I'm gonna show y'all the inside of it first. All right, first, this thing has gotten 115 horsepower Mercury motor. This thing's nice. This thing will really make this thing fly through the water. It's awesome. And yeah, so that's the motor. And then when you come down here, got your you know compartment this is like just a little storage compartment right here this is a this is part of a live well and then this is the other side of the live well right here and then let's see back here I think is another just another like little storage area um, I love the, the interior the gray carpet that the the seats look awesome and yeah here's some extra oops extra seats right here these are, you can have them you know, right here. Whatever, you know. Uh, I'm gonna ignore these for right now. But, all right, so that's the back side of the boat. Then you got, you come here to the middle. You got two seats. This thing is pretty sweet right here, this. So, I'm gonna re reveal this for you guys. All right, this is the fish finder right here. We had it covered up. So, it's a Lowrance uh, HDS8. It's not a touch screen, but you know, it's, it's, a it's really nice, it's got, you know, navigation, depth, you know, structure, every, it's, it's got everything on it. There's one here. There's one up there too, which I'll get to later. Uh, they connect. So yeah, let's go ahead and cover this back up. These are all your like buttons right here. There's like a light, the power button. Like I'm, I'm still like learning all the buttons and everything there is to know about this. So I don't even really know a lot about this part, but you know, you got your, your horn. Oh, it's not on. So your horn like that. Let's make sure you turn that back off. So yeah. All right, headed to the front of the boat now. This is, um, I think this is the main storage. This is like a good main storage space right here. Um, yeah, you can put like your tackle bag in there or whatever. Close that up. This is rod. Oh, it's locked. This one's rod holder. You can like put, you know, rods in there, whatever. Extra stuff, extra long stuff. You have like nets or whatever. Um, all right, and let's see, this one right here. Uh, we got blankets in there, um, and then you know you can put your life jackets. We got a paddle in there, just extra. Has a lot of storage space, which is nice because a lot of times when you have bring a bunch of stuff on the boat, you know you run out of space to put it. So it's nice. Has a ton of storage, storage space. All right, now we're getting to the trolling motor part. So this is cool because it's got a um, pedal thing. I don't really know what you call it, like a step thing, or it's got a remote. I like the remote. Because whenever you have this chair up here, if you're not fishing, you sit up here, you know, and you're, you know, you're controlling it. It's pretty sweet. It's a nice stroll motor too. It's the Minn Kota Teroa, I think is how you say it. Um, so yeah, that's pretty sweet. So, so like I said, it's got this pedal thing. This is the other depth finder I was talking about. It connects to the other one. And yeah, and then you got the main stroll motor. This thing's nice. Uh, all you do, I'm not going to lower it right now because I don't want it to hit anything, but you step down. But you step down, push this in, pull it, and it comes out. So yeah, this is just a great boat. I'm super happy. Uh, it's a great beginner bass boat. You know, it's um, you know I'm sure we'll upgrade in the future, but this is a great one to you know start with, and it's just this is nice. I'm really excited to be using it out in the water. So yeah, 
Thank you guys so much for tuning in to this day's video. Be sure to smash that subscribe button if you haven't already. Give this video a like, comment down below like some video ideas. And uh, yeah, sorry I haven't been posting in a while. Uh, it's been hard, you know, with school and all that. I hope you guys understand. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll catch you guys on the next episode.